and the replay. What's up everybody, Pat the Stinky here, and I uh, wanted to share this video with you guys. Quick tutorial on how to fix your M2TS issues. Uh, if you're trying to import an M2TS uh, file into Sony Vegas, doesn't matter what version you have. I've tried them all, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Um, if you have the latest updates from Hop Hog for your HD PVR, that's what's causing the issue. So let's look it up. Hop Hog, there it is. And I show you what I'm talking about. If you go to support, pick what you got, XD PVR. This driver right here, 1.71, this is what's giving you the issues. Um, I ended up purchasing another PVR after I sold mine a year ago. Um, <clears throat> only because I decided to make more videos, obviously, since we had the subscriber lobby for zombies about a few days ago. Um, what happened was I tend to record all my gameplay and edit it on the weekend. So I have like a week's worth of uh, gameplay. As you can see here, this is my secondary hard drive. Look at this. These are all gameplays. All of these videos, no good. I can't import any one of these into uh, Sony Vegas. So I'll show you exactly what's happening. Um, let's go to subscribe to lobby. Right here, M2TS. Now, I grab this, I drag it over, see how it's dragging over. Once I get to Sony Vegas, though, it disappears and the whole computer freezes up. Now, I tried everything. Again, I tried different versions of Sony Vegas. I've tried Windows XP, Windows 7, uh, Vista. I've tried it on different PCs. Um, I've tried it all, I've tried it all. And the only thing that fixes it is uninstalling the 1.7 driver and installing a, a, a later version uh, 1.5 so here let me force this to close close this out now what you want to do is right here 1.5 I don't know if you guys can see that or not but uh, that's what you want to Google and try to download. Now, unfortunately, I can't link it here because you know I don't want to get in trouble or whatnot. But that's the driver that you want. Um, this is what it looks like: HCW driver installed.exe. That's what you want to install, um, and that's going to fix all your issues. Before you do that, though, you want to make sure that you uninstall. I'm running um, Total Media Extreme only because I don't like Showbiz. So uh, you want to make sure you uninstall this before you downgrade your driver using the uh, 1.57.0. All right, and I'll show you exactly what happens when you do that. So let's open up Vegas because Vegas just took a dump. All right, so there's Vegas. Also, I even tried loading it from Sony itself and still same issue. So let's navigate over to my secondary hard drive. I mean, it's big. I got like, I think like 30 gigs in here. All right. So I did a bunch of tests. As you can see here, I got test six, which was the last test because I did it for length and size. I thought size um, was the issue where I wasn't importing. Um, I even tried to, I even tried to record it as a MP4, and I was still having issues importing it into Sony. So uh, I did these five tests: four, three, two, one. I did a bunch of these. Anyway, I'll show you the sixth test. This is what happens when you downgrade your driver and you try to import this video into Sony Vegas. See? Already loaded. And uh, I'll play it. That might be a little choppy because of the software, the capture software that I'm using now to capture this video uh, to show you guys. But look, as you can see, it's instant. You know, like this is how it should be. This is how we used to load. This is how we used to load when I first had the HD PVR. Perfect, seamlessly, you know, so uh, yeah, that's the issue. Um, I'm going to show another video, if you click on the upper right-hand corner, which is going to show you how to fix all these bad files. Like, look at all these files. I don't want to lose this. I was thinking about deleting it and starting over, but I got too much good gameplay. So uh, I got another video coming up. Click on the upper right-hand corner, and uh, it'll show you how to reconvert these so that you can actually use them. Um, if you found this useful, please leave a comment. Also, press the like button. And try to get this out to as many people as you can. Uh, the more people that view, is it, view this, the more people that comment and and um, you know and like uh, this will actually you know go out to a lot more people. So whatever, that's what I'm looking for is to help others. Cause I mean, it took me an entire Saturday to figure this shit out, and 
I mean, I tried it all, tried it all, tried it all, and this is the only thing that, that works, was downgrading the driver to 1.5.7.0. All right, guys, so uh, good luck, and uh, check the link in the description. Well, not a link in the description, but check the description for uh, the file name, how you used to search it, all right?